Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I am teaching you how to hold your frog. Now, I'll just say a bit about frogs. So, the thing is, is frogs don't... Frogs don't... Through their skin. So you can't have chemicals like slime or soap on your hands. And you need to get unchlorinated water and put it in a bowl. So you need some water with no chlorine in it because that's really bad for them. So I'm gonna get some water. So I have a water filter. So I just got all this unchlorinated water. And then you want, and you can't hold them that much because it uh, kind of like isn't too good for them. So you can't like, don't hold them every day, but you can like, you can hold them and like, I don't hold it in mine for very long, maybe like 20 seconds, but really depends on what you think. And if your frog is a tadpole and, or a froglet and you teach them to be held, it'll be easy to hold them when they're older. Our frog, when we got it, I was too little, so, and, and, I, and my brother was even littler, so it was like, kind of like, you don't want them picking up the frogs and like putting them in the sink or something. So I've had to retrain my frog to be held. So I'm gonna get my, I'm gonna get the water and I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna, and then you just get the water, I'll show you. Get your water and you just wanna put your hand yeah. in the water like that. So your hands are covered in the water. Because you need to have water on your hands, otherwise it like, stings their skin. And it's still probably not good for them to have, still hold your hand, like hold them in your hand. But it's better than no water. So next, I'll show you. Okay, so this is Sam. Get my hand. He's kind of a small. What you want to do is kind of do this. And kind of hold their bottom. And then he will hop off eventually. And it's kind of harder to hold them because they'll jump away. Once you've already held them. Like they don't want to be held again. And if you have like dirt or critter crumble or whatever you use as the flooring or gravel... It does stick to their skin, so you'll have like dirt on your hands, and you want to wash that because probably won't be good having weird because they eat like bugs and stuff. So you want to wash it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm doing a lot of pet videos at the moment, and yeah, leave a like if you want to see more. Bye.